more significant EJ is these two teams are only playing three times. So with the Spurs having won one game already, the Suns looking to secure this in an effort to find. Straight away look there from DA over the top of Aldridge. Suns come up with their own defensive gym up top to Kelly Oubre Jr. who punches it down and put on the smaller forwards. Picks it across the paint, kicks it out to Oubre, sets and fires another straightaway three. Spurs coming off a big win last night. And a travel there on the Marcus Aldridge. They need to be careful of him really abusing teams in the mid-range. And now they're backing off of him, and he, they're giving him a clear look at the three. Murray contested pull up, but that one gets off the hands of Aiton. Sets up a reset on the shot clock for San Antonio. Here's a guy like Devin Booker that loves to operate inside the line. And as much as any, EJ, that is so important for the Suns to remember their formula under Monty Williams, which is that point five as Monty Williams wants it and can't get the bounce with that one. Yeah, sometimes he shoots it with a line drive and he's already looking down in the basket. He's got to get a little bit more air under that shot. Rose and a rare miss inside. When you think about it, D.A., of course, missed the game there in Mexico City back on December. Did not play in the game last January. So it has been over a year since eight in his face is San Antonio Spurs team. You know, around those offensive rebounds, you got to keep a body on them if you're Ricky Rubio. Or you just you can't afford to give away those 50-50 balls. As so then they'll throw stuff like that in. He's stepping into the triple, won't get it, but tap back to Rubio. Over to Carter. He lets another three-pointer fly. No, on the follow, Ubre had a hand on it, and tough break there is that. Well, again, that's hustle back, right? He didn't take for granted that he was going to make the layup. He hustled back, and that's something on film that Monty will take advantage of with his, with his team stuff that's going to get you consistent wins. And right now, turnovers are the problems for the Suns. That is their ninth. And here is Forbes. Is Forbes struggling with his three-point shooting. He was 5 of 26 over the last four games coming in, but he's knocked down a couple here. And the Spurs with DeRozan got away with a travel there. Pulls it out as they get the switch. Aiton stepping out. That little Euro step back. DeRozan gets the roll. It might have been a Euro being done inside the paint. You can understand. Swings it out to Forbes. He's hit a couple threes and making three. He can keep him going. Swings had enough of a... Hot three-point shooter in Boston Saturday night. The career-high 11 threes coming from Marcus Smart as DeRozan comes up short with... ...deserves to be an all-star. And they've seen it here firsthand. They speak to his scoring ability, his accomplishments, the stats that he's been putting up night in and night out, his leadership and... Likes to the fact that he's been wide open, too. I mean, he, he, got a, he got a couple being wide open, and now it's just difficult. White looking for a three, and he'll get it. About a three-second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. Ruby on the drive, finds the cutting bridges, and Suns turn it over again. Well, keep an eye on Forbes. He communicate here, and don't let him shake free. Rosen on the inbound, trying to get it to Forbes. Gets it, double clutch. Well, had one of his better halves he's had in his career. And then just patience on offense. Sun shot 46%. I think it could be better. Uh, they need to take advantage of a team that has struggled this year and keep going at it. But when you, you got three, the you don't want to roll the dice. Here's DeRozan at a quiet first half for the most part at six points. Bump there by Aiton, and that'll be an easy. DeRozan knocking down the free throws. So half of his eight points have come from the line. He does have six assists, though, as Oubre draws the contact. Foul there by the numbers are not on the side of Red Forbes at the very least to continue to shoot six of seven as Aldridge with another San Antonio block. I don't know what happened. Did Pirtle touch his arm? Uh, see, I'm telling you, that's, see, that's that orange. Oubre lost the handle. Suns nearly turn it over again, and they eventually do. Twelfth turnover that have led to 18 San Antonio points. Make it 21. Here's you. 
break this game down, EJ, and it's pretty simple. As we said going to break, is Aiden's fadeaway comes up short. He's got to play through that, right? If he plays through it, then he'll get the foul. But if you allow him to push you and you fade away, then that takes you away from the contact. Here's Forbes, who did his damage from the three-point line. And Nackers would love to get going, but you can see the Spurs defensively draped all over him. Yeah, that's a tough shot there for them. He's got a guy with sides on him, and Lyle did a very good job. Yeah, Lyle, 6'10". Drive inside by DeRozan, gets his own miss, and then Aiton rips it away on the loose ball. Look, with the dribble hesitation, able to get right to the rim. He made all good stick. The Suns obviously know they can't get it all back in one possession, but DeRozan connects on the quick pull up. He's flirting 18 minutes. Great to see him back playing after that ACL injury. Good deep to block. White tried to get a foul call by jumping into the chest of Aiton. He stayed straight up. There's Jacobo on the drive, tied up by Mills, eventually stolen. 13th turnover for the Suns. Jacobo driving to pass instead of driving to think shot first and then pass. DeRozan inside, knocked off his spoke break, comes up short on that attempt. You've got a team coming in here traveling on a back-to-back -back and just unable to full team to go with Devin if he can get this game a little bit closer. Here's DeRozan. He's got a dozen points, seven rebounds, seven assists. Nice defense there, and then a late whistle. San Antonio, they do go to Cold Street. Off to Rubio. Can't get that one. Part of us wish that was Rubio pushing it, and Devin was the recipient, right? Here's DeRozan working on Aiton. Aiton stands his ground, forces the miss. San Antonio has won 17 of the last 19 meetings against this Suns team. DeRozan sneaks it up inside past Aiton. Might have a lead. You always have a chance to catch up. You see a number of games this year where teams have 20 point leads and it evaporates within a quarter. Get back in this game. Defense. They've taken the Spurs away from their option of getting to the rim, and they have missed shot after shot here late. The Rosen's dropped on here. They have ramped their defense up, and the Spurs now trigger happy in the first half. A little hesitant now. Oubre reaching, the Rosen driving. He gets the finish. That was filthy. <laughs> the Rosen. Trying to barrel his way inside, tied up by Bridges. Great defense there, right? Stayed up high on DeRozan. It's a Rubio. Ronnie's really squeezing onto these timeouts here. Let's see if the Suns can execute. Rubio on the drive. Gets a connection. The finish. Stay up high. Tied up. DeRozan puts it on the deck. Swings it out to Forbes. High arching three. His first. Yeah. Draws the double. Off to Oubre, he's cut off there by DeRozan. Aiton can't get that one. The Suns unable to get a rebound. You've got to get the rebound here. DeRozan working on Bridges. Comes up short on that turnaround. 